Well, one day the Germans came and said everybody who is uh, able to walk should come to a special place, and we all came. I came with my parents too, and then the organizer, the German uh, high officer came and said, well, everybody out, everybody has to march where he tells us, and I should go out. We need you. So I said I would go out only if you allow me to take my parents. And he was very abrupt and said, uh, you are arrogant. You should be happy that I let you out. You can't take your parents. How old were your parents at the time? Well, in their late 60s. How many people would you say were part of this group? Hundred fifty, two hundred. First, they had them all in in a very large room for hours and no facilities to relieve themselves. So I went to the German who ordered it and asked him whether I can bring some pears or something. So he let me take a bathtub, an empty bathtub from another house, and I brought it in, and so the people uh, relieved themselves before they went to the train to go, I don't know, to Treblinka or to Auschwitz. I don't, don't know where they went. Did people know where they no. were going? No. What were they told? Resettlement. What did that word mean to you? I didn't, I didn't know it. I didn't know that it means death. I know it's something horrible, but I, I couldn't understand. Well, I understood, but it just didn't sink in that something like that can happen. Just before this occurred, did you have any access to information? No. No radio, no newspapers, no nothing. Did you hear people discuss what the possibilities were? Yes, but no, the gruesome possibilities. We didn't hear about gas. We didn't hear about mass murder or uh, putting people into the uh, river. We didn't know that. At least I didn't know. Maybe some other people knew and didn't speak about it. Was there a rabbi in no. the group? Maybe it was, but not officially. I don't know any rabbi. What was the people's behavior like when they were told to gather? Sad. Sad, completely hopeless. Meek. Were there children in the group? Yes. Were the children crying? One child asked me whether death hurts. 